Hey guys, this is Evan at uh, Go Power Sports here in Fort Worth, Texas. Here's your pro tip for the day. So you bought yourself a Coleman. You put a torque converter on it, but you got no power. Here's what's going on. So what you want to do once you've got your air cleaner assembly off, you want to remove the throttle cable and the spring here. Reattach your throttle cable because when you give it throttle and that is all the way compressed, look at all this throttle that you're missing. I've got an assembly here to show you what the finished product should look like. See we have our mini mid return spring here. What this does is allows you to get full range of throttle which is gonna give you the required RPMs to operate our torque converter system on your Coleman. You can find that spring on our website right here. All right, the other thing you're gonna to wanna to do is take this tab here and either cut it off or bend it back and make sure that your screw here with a Phillips screwdriver is backed all the way out. And by the way, this Coleman torque converter hack here is for your CT200U your CT200U EX and your BT200. It's a quick recap, we're removing the throttle spring, adding our mini mid return spring, and also bending down the tab there on the throttle mechanism. That allows you to get full range of throttle to get the RPMs required to operate your torque converter. Thank you guys for tuning in, and uh, here at Go Power Sports, there's no excuse to be slow.